Hey, 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 hey! This is a, another Chaos and Comics review. Today, I am reviewing Invisible City, Invisible Kingdoms. Not this, it's not an Italo Calvino book. This is Invisible Kingdom. This is by G. Willow Wilson as the writer and Christian Ward as the artist and Sal Cipriano as the letterer. letterer. If you hear Christian Ward, you know, you know you're going to get that cool paint style. Uh, I love Christian Ward, one of my favorite artists uh, in the whole wide world. I feel like Odyssey didn't really end with him and Matt Fraction. Maybe you have to go look and maybe it did end, but it felt like it just went dot, dot, dot for a book that a lot of people liked. Um, but so beautiful art, um, story is cool. The characters are creative. The, uh, uh, the aliens are very creative, especially with that painted style. They do look very different. Sometimes you, you lose a little detail for that, for, you know, the beautiful colors and vibrant stuff. There's a give and take. Uh, the, the thing that I've been talking about when I have reviewed this, uh, even before when I was just doing like mini reviews in my comic halls or whatever, is that I was, I've just continued to hope that this is not a, uh, the typical backdrop of corporations are evil and religions are evil. They're too big and they're monoliths. Uh, I, I mean, I believe that I think that's the reality of the world today, but uh, I always hope that I get a little bit of a, of a spin on something when it comes to art. So, that doesn't mean that the comic's not good, doesn't have a, a great grade, but it's it's what I want to like sort of focus on in this uh, video, in that G. Willow Wilson's a really good writer, and I can tell, and the dialogue's great, and, and the plotting is real tight, and every issue is extremely entertaining, but it is set on something very basic and and really, really just played out. You know, like, everything is rocks on corp, everything is evil corporation and some crazy history. Now the way these two are meeting and the way these two characters meet, they finally meet in, in this book, uh, is interesting and it's still very beautiful and the art brings it up to another level. Uh, but I, I'm still holding on a little hope that we get a, a cool little twist and it is, just is an evil, evil corporation versus uh, evil religion and the little man is stuck in between. So that doesn't mean it can't be a great story. It just means it's it's set up with pretty art and and somewhat basic. But it's still really early in this book. Uh, the you could tell when the plotting is real tight that she probably has like twenty issues pretty much ready in her head, not necessarily like ready to print, but ready in her head. And it, it's definitely one of my favorite books of the year so far. And I will continue reading it and and see where this really interesting fun world sort of takes me that another another space opera i just i'm a sucker for that and now that astro hustle got canceled because the dude was a little bit weird uh i'm gonna have to really live with uh, g willow wilson who is the complete opposite and probably would call out that dude anyway thank you very much for watching this video are you reading invisible cities what do you think about it you just want to tell your mama jokes at the bottom. You do whatever you want in the comments. You guys have a great day. Thank you very much for watching. See you later.